Hello and welcome to your daily love reading for Saturday. My name's Liz and this is Guided by Angels. And I'm going to bring in three decks of cards today to connect with the connection, to connect with the energy around you, your person, your journey, and see what you need to know. And if you would like a personal reading with me, you can reach out to me at guidedbyangelsxo at gmail.com. So I'm going to bring in the beautiful Mary Magdalene Oracle today. I'm also going to bring in the Radiant Rider Waite Tarot to bring in some simple and clear messages. And I'm going to bring in the beautiful Divine Oracle by our soul sister Cherie from Divine Visions. So thank you, angels. What do we need to know today? So what's the energy around you today? Or the guidance for you from heaven? What do you need to know today? What's the message coming in for you? Thank you, angels. So I've got one card coming out very clearly. What's the energy around your person? Wow, two cards flew out of the deck. One on the floor there as well. And what's the energy around the divine connection that you share? Your twin flame journey, your soulmate connection, you know, whatever you were tapping into this reading for, you will get an answer to your question today. So we got an answer about your journey right now. And then with the divine visions oracle, what's the energy right now around you? we got one card. What's the energy around your person today? The energy around your person today. We've got two cards and another card sticking out here. And the energy around your amazing journey. Got a few cards sticking out the deck and this one jumped out. And then we're going to use the tarot as well. So what's the energy right now around you? Look at that jumping out. Wow, good news is on the way for you. That's amazing. The energy around the person that you were thinking of, your special person. And the energy around the connection. Wow, two cards. Very clear messages coming out today. Very quick, very precise. And this is because we're in March energy. There's breakthroughs, there's big things going on. So let's connect with the energy around you. So in the tarot, we've got the page of wands. This is a great card to come out for you. It's saying to you, good news is on the horizon. Results are ahead. And you may already feel that way. You know, last night when we did the Them To You reading, we got such a powerful message coming through with the motorbikes that came through during the reading. So if you see motorbikes, that's a huge sign of speed and breakthroughs and change. So good news is on the way. We've also got, look at this, peace and forgiveness. When you work on finding inner peace, when you work on forgiveness, forgiving yourself, forgiving them, forgiving the karmic situation, forgiving the situation itself, it will lead to good news. So if you want more good news in your life, if you want to bring good news into your connection, if you want to receive good news from your person, work on forgiveness and peace today. And this beautiful kind of white flower is that energy of cleansing. I feel there's a great cleansing taking place right now and a great healing. And if you've been seeing black feathers or dark feathers, that's also a sign to forgive. It's a sign of forgiveness. If you're seeing white feathers, that's what I'm seeing this as as well. It's a sign of protection. That's that sign of peace. So I feel you may see feathers. You may also be receiving messages throughout your dreams. You know, dreaming of your person, dreaming about the situation, cleansing things in dreams, maybe even forgiving, looking for peace. So good news is on the way when you forgive. And also forgiving yourself, remember. And the guidance is... We've got the fourth power. This is really powerful. I am beloved. So remember, you are loved. You are strong. You are powerful. You are beautiful. You are you. And when you operate in that energy, you feel loved. You feel connected. You feel strong. And you rise above anything that's going on. And the power is in you. You know, in the four, the fourth energy there, the fourth that I'm connecting with is four, four, four angel protection. So you may be shown those feathers today as a sign of comfort and forgiveness. You may be shown the number 444 as a sign of power. And you definitely mean shown that you are safe. And remember, the fourth power can also be connected with the fourth chakra. So this is also very powerfully connected with your heart and the way you feel inside, trusting what you feel in your heart. Love is what's real. Love is the answer to all of your questions. So the powerful energy of 444. Now the energy around your person today, we've got the seven of pentacles. This is very powerful. So this shows you that they are changing their mindset. 
They are focusing now on what they want. They are thinking about you today. So when I'm connecting with this, they are thinking about you today. They are visualizing being with you today. They are working out how they can be with you. You know, they are planning. They're in that planning phase to make their dreams a reality. So they may be working today or whatever they're doing. Maybe they're even working in the garden today. You know, they could be mowing the lawn or they could be out in the garden and they stop what they are doing and they have that moment where they connect with you. So wherever they are today, whether at work, at home, in the garden, busy doing something else, they are having moments where they will stop what they are doing and they are thinking about you. And that's getting their attention. It's making them think about you in a powerful way. Yeah, look at this, pay attention to the signs. And there's that white feather we've just spoken about. So they are being shown signs today from heaven that remind them of you, that make them stop in their tracks and stop what they are doing and think about you, connect with you, you know, plan being with you. So the feather is that symbol of protection and that symbol of comfort. And what I'm feeling is when they receive the signs about you today that make them stop and think about you, they feel very comforted. They feel warm, they feel safe, they feel like they've come home because that's how they feel when they connect with you. They feel, look at this, divinely connected. And I love this card, it says, the cards before and after this one hold great significance when put together. So the, the journey itself is divinely connected, they feel that, they know that, they are stopping to think about that today and the card before this one is pay attention to the signs. So when they are noticing the signs and paying attention to them, they remember that you are divinely connected and that allows them to tap into their creative spirit through music, through signs, through things that bring in peace. When they connect with you, they remember your beauty. So remember the card before and after this when put together. And I'm seeing that as how they see you, beautiful, romantic, lovable, everything they've ever wanted. And when they connect with you in that way, they remember who they are and they tap into their creative spirit because with you by their side, they can do anything. They can achieve anything. And we've got the cave of eggs. So eggs are very much connected with breaking wide open you know what do we do we crack an egg to really bring out what's inside so we have to crack sometimes to bring out our true self to bring out what's inside and when we crack you know when we feel broken when we go within you know the egg is also about an incubation period so when we go within or when they go into their cave and do some deep thinking they realize that you exist within each other we exist in and with each other. You recognize and realize that you are one. So don't worry if they are in their cave right now, you know, processing, thinking, or they seem to have retreated. There's about to be a breakthrough. You know, the egg is a symbol of breaking out of that shell, taking off that mask. And I'm also feeling this is what's happening between now and Easter. And it's really powerful because my divine masculine, George Blue Eyes Tarot, he did a reading on his channel um, the other day and it was so powerful. He was talking about water energy and the, the Gemini energy and he was talking about how your person is coming to the realization of what this love is. And it really feels that's what's happening between the season of Pisces and the energy around Gemini. So between now and June. And this is what I'm feeling things are speeding up, things are getting better, quicker, lots of things are happening. So I'm connecting with Easter energy here as well. And they want to see you fully, you know, they know that with you, they are fully seen. So in other words, they feel seen, heard and understood with you. And I know sometimes you don't feel like they see you or they hear you or understand you, but they absolutely do. They do in a higher way. So the witness energy is about understanding <clears throat> they give me a block that when they go into their cave, whenever there's a block or a delay, they realize that you see them for who they are, that you want them for who they are. And you come together in that way. You know, this is really powerful. You know, for example, regardless of how you see Mary Magdalene and Jesus, Jesus saw Mary in her true essence, in her true light, in her true power, regardless of how she was seen by others. So always remember that your twin flame, your special person will see you the way you really are, just like you see them the way they really are without the masks or the illusion. 
So the energy around the connection today, we've got three of pentacles. So this is about connecting in a higher way. If you connect with them in a higher way, you're going to feel them in a higher way. So this is definitely about working on that inner union, working on the connection on the 5D realm. And guess what that does? That leads to your outer union in the physical world. So what I'm connecting here is I've got a timeline coming in for unions occurring between March, where we are today, and October this year. I feel many of you are going to come into union this year. And that means the permanent relationship where you stay together, you have a life together, a home, maybe you have family, you may make children together or you may already have kids and you bring them together. There's a creation of the relationship taking place and it all begins with you and it all begins now. So focus on that powerful inner union to create the outer union that you seek. And I also feel this is about connecting with them in a higher way. And they are definitely doing that today with you because they are stopping what they are doing when the signs come in and they are thinking about you. So this is such a great message about union ahead, that permanent relationship, having that life together. Because you're weaving magic into the situation and you're doing that today. And look at this, you're almost there. You're almost there. So there's magic coming into this situation. You are learning and growing because you are almost there. You are almost there. Things are falling into place. So allow the angels to guide you like a guiding light. And you shine your light like a guiding light so your person can find their way home because miracles are being manifested now. Miracles are now being manifested and look at this, we've got the dove, spirit speaks through the body, this is so powerful because we've got the dove coming through today, you know, these signs are coming up throughout this reading, we've got the dove, there's the dove, we've got the harp, that's a symbol of peace and power, we've got the feather, a sign of comfort and angel protection and love, we've got the energy of the 444, the energy of the powerful peace and forgiveness. And now we've got the spirit speaking you, to you through your body. So remember, your body is, is speaking to you. It's reacting or responding to things. And you feel it in your intuition. You feel it in your solar plexus, your stomach, your gut instinct. The body never lies. You feel it in the heart. Your heart will beat faster. Your heart will skip a beat. You feel that power. And you know inside of you that good news is coming. You feel it. You know this is happening. So the good news today is that they are stopping and thinking about you. They are breaking free from their past. They know that you are divinely connected and that you are one and that you are manifesting your union and that's all taking place now because outer union is just an extension of inner union. So the message today is whatever's going on, remember you were almost there. So work on peace, forgiveness, feeling each other within each other, knowing that they do see you and understand you regardless of how things seem and that the universe has got your back. So have a spring in your step today and feel good because magic is coming in and all the signs are showing that to you. Have a great day, sending you so much love and I'll see you soon.